what is going down guys it's me from Jack Designs and yeah well today I'm going to be showing you this little effect that I've been playing around with on Photoshop and got working which is basically this blueprint kind of style effect that you can apply to pretty much any image within reason a few images I've tried didn't work as well as this one but I found this Desert Eagle image that you can see here and basically I'm going to show you today how to do this blueprint effect and it's a fairly simple effect and it only takes a few stages but it can really really be effective so I've already magic wanded around the gun itself I've just got this blueprint background that I've made and all I'm going to do is select my gun layer or whatever layer it is that you want to apply the blueprint effect to go to stylize find edges all this is going to do is draw out this kind of color black and white kind of pencil sketch outline which is great but you know it doesn't really look blueprinty so if you were going for a sketch effect I guess you could use this just to find the edges it's quite a good way of doing it However, I'm going to go a bit different, uh, go for a kind of more advanced thing, as you saw in the previous one, which is kind of to have a white sketch, you know, like so it looks like it's an actual blueprint. So uh, the important thing to note is this picture was pretty grayscale, but if you don't have a grayscale image, press Control, Shift, and U, and that will remove all the coloured lines which might appear from your find edges effect. Uh, from the actual image. So if I was to use a more complex image and not a grayscale one such as a gun, uh, there'd be maybe a few red, yellow, green lines appear. So to get rid of them it's just Command Shift U or Control Shift U if you're on a Windows computer. The next stage is to invert the colours. Now to do this all you have to press is Command and I and that is going to flip the colours around. So now we've got this weird like black inline effect. It doesn't look right. But all you're going to do now is go to your layer and you're going to select Screen as your blending option and all this does is it basically gets rid of all the black areas and there you go guys you've pretty much got the blueprint effect there if you want to play around with it just go to levels create your clipping mask so it's only going to affect the gun layer and then just feel free to play around with layers to remove add all that good shazam of lines but I'm going to leave it there you know you can play around with the amount of lines that you have shown as shown there but guys that's pretty much the tutorial if this tutorial has helped you uh, with your blueprint effect please give the video a like so other people can find it and other than that guys I really hope this tutorial helps if you've enjoyed the tutorial and it's taught you new please drop a like on the video it's really appreciated and I'm hoping to do a few more tutorials on this channel and I'll talk to you very soon so see you in a bit guys thanks for watching